Somebody tell me where we are. Homer. <laughs> Where's that? The spit in Alaska. <laughs> the Homer spit in Alaska. Silver Fox. Silver Fox 2. With Captain Denny. And we're going halibut fishing. Or air 
Jason over there.
for the whale. We're excited. We can't even stand it. We're getting there. We're almost there. Anchors Remember, guys. Two fish till everybody's caught one. Yeah. That's every man for himself. So you're saying everybody catches two, or everybody catches one, and then everybody catches two. Or if, if ever, once every, somebody's caught one, but you need to check. If you catch two, make sure everybody else has caught their one before you catch anything else. Show us what we're using for bait. Exactly. Jellyfish. 
This is what I just caught. Yeah, <laughs> yeah buddy. Uh, caught it with your fingers, huh? We ready to fish. Yeah, we are. Four days ago, Daddy and caught 982 pounds. The what? Was here four days ago, and caught 982 pounds. Okay. Well. <laughs> give it a try. Well, we didn't catch anything in that last spot, so we decided to troll for a little while. trolling line tied to the bow. There it is right there. Let me see if I can follow it back to the lure. Okay, there's our lure right there. We're after the big one. On, Steve? Yeah. Jim, you got a fish on? Yeah, man. Chris, you got a fish on? Yeah, buddy. Dr. Lindsay, you got a fish on? Yeah. Zach got a fish on? No. I got a fish on. Yeah. You all get one on. That's fine. Well, Zach's got one on. We all got one on. We got six fish on. Leave it head under the water, and I'll be there in a minute. Jim, what do you? What's been in your pole? Uh, fish. Oh. Let's see what you got. Oh, there's Chris's fish. Excuse me. All right, Christopher. Oh, don't videotape me. <laughs> What's the matter, Mike? He slew him. Rip his lips off again. Okay, it's recording. There you go. All right. Like, Woo -hoo. This is like tuna fishing. Oh, oh man. There you go. That's a nice fish. Oh, that looks like nice fish. Oh, my girl is going to be tired after this one. Oh, man. Right, bottom, See if we've got a fish Dad, here. Okay. Go. Oh. Oh. Woo. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. Oh. Well, I don't think he's down here. All right. Woo-hoo! I haven't even gotten a reel. You're not sure. That was 24 out there. Come on, Charlie. Oh, yeah. That looks good. Good form. Good form. Oh, man! That looks like a good size fish. Remember, use your body. Use your body. Pull back. Now hold the pole against your body and then use your back. Line dance song. What are you puffing about, Dixon? What am I puffing about? <laughs> this is 257 Chevy, sir. You gotta get the man, for this. You might have a tank on the end. This might be a nice fish. Mm hmm Because he sure don't want to move much. You're I'm doing good, Charlie. Attention on the one. Woo! I wanna see you catch one bigger than you. 
That was so cool. As soon as you <laughs> dropped the bottle. Give <laughs> Part of it's the current, but it's still that's not a bad fish. I mean, you. He's just getting weak now. Yeah. You talking about me? <laughs> yeah, it seems like a big fish because I'm oh, running no, out of steam. There he is. You got him once. Down there, fish. You got All him right, twice. good action. This is the bass fisherman here. here. He knows how to set the hook. Darn, huh? No, sometimes it picks up really, really fast. Oh, I bet. There's just a point I'm going, when are they not going to be able to hit the bottom? Mm -hmm. oh. So you fish during the wintertime, too? No, we could quit in September. But, I mean, do you go somewhere else? Oh, no, I, I work in civil service for the Air Force. Dead. Right. For a 120-day contract. So that gives me a month off after this is over and a month. A oh, well, yeah, yeah. I thought you said you went to Fiji or something. Well, I did, but the last winter and this winter, I've been doing that, I think. All right, Charlie, tell me, uh, how's, <laughs> there's drinks in the cooler. how does it feel, Charlie, now that you have a fish on and you've been fighting it for the last 20 minutes? Are you ready to go to Disneyland? Yeah, baby. Oh. It's the way to go. There's <laughs> no place like it in the world. This is a horse. That baby, he ain't moving either. I think we got three fish on. Oh, he's fighting. Howdy. I think this guy has a, a rock on the end of his pole. He's been reeling up this rock for the past uh, 15 minutes. You gonna mount that rock on the wall when you get it out of the water? Yes, sir. <laughs> the captain's giving him a kind of a break here. Yeah, I wish the captain would come over and give me a break. <laughs> come on. This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Yeah, and I'm done. You want to catch it, it's all yours. It's all your effort. And it's going to be like one of those 20-pounders that i got to throw what back. I, what I was doing is keeping my biceps tense. Not, not working this arm. Keep my arm locked in this wheel. Put the camera on the rock. Thank you, sir. I didn't take it away from you, though. Oh, no, no. I won't, but I'm on my arm rest for a minute here, and I won't. How come that rod tip's bent? <laughs> you better load your gun. That is a nice fish. He's slowly, is this slowly bringing it up. a really good fighter. Or he is just not coming. Uh, I got a stick there with his mouth open there, Denny. It took me a long well, time to line that up. Depending on how far... How hard are you pulling? No bikes, Grandpa? No, I have a nibble. You want to come reel this one? No. You want to come reel this no, one? No, go ahead. He's pulling back with all his might, slowly, with some effort, not much. He's getting the fish into the boat. Charles is uh, showing. The effort of a true fisherman. Although we're, we're concerned he may have hooked onto the anchor because the uh, <laughs> boat may be drifting. I think I hooked on the Bismarck. Is there such a thing as the great white halibut? <laughs> uh, no, only in, in the legend. Them. What? He took a breather. I don't have to <laughs> We'll have to edit that later. <laughs> Whoa. I hope you can see this rod tip action. It's incredible. Matched up against fatigue on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that arch. Check out that back arch. That is true fatigue. I think you guys got some tandem action going here. Knees buckling. This could be oh, uh, a future Olympian event. Event. Yeah. Uh, tandem uh, halibut fishing. I want to get that knot in my spool. The American team. I think I, I lost my fish. I don't know if I. 
got strength to reel on this, this is This is a line without a fish on it, or, or a rod without a fish on it. This is one with a fish. There's, there's some similarity in that they're both the same color. But you can see the one with a fish has a slight flex to it, whereas the one without the fish is rather straight. You ready to uh, start pulling again there, Chris? This is going to get kind of tedious for a while, so I will photograph the fish when we can first see it. So I'm signing off. I'll let him take the picture for me. You do it until I turn around just then. I just decided to uh, begin recording because the doctor has also caught a fish. Now we have four poles going. He didn't catch it. He hooked no, it. He hooked oh, it. Uh, I'm oh, sorry. He catches when they're in the boat. <laughs> catches when they're... I have been corrected. <laughs> and uh, I yield to the captain who has just a little bit more experience than I do. Okay, here's a fish. It's going to the surface. He's coaxing it, coaxing it towards the boat. Here comes mine. That's a good shot of the captain's butt. <laughs> and here's the fish. There it is. Here's one. I'm going to have to get out of your way here. Okay. okay. Here she comes. There's two of them. Oh, yeah, Oh, my. No. That is a rare occasion where you have a dose fish. A dose. Dose fish, two fish. It's a double whammy. It's a more of a whammy for the captain because he has to try to entangle it. And uh, it's not light. This is true halibut fishing action at its finest. <laughs> or its most frustrating. I'm afraid Charlie lost his fish. <laughs> but he is a good sport. I don't know what his fish came off. Yeah. This was a bigger of the two. I got him, he's biting me. You got a good fish, dude. There's the winner. Keep it up. So basically, we're going to take the biggest of these thousand fish to get on. Like, another one the biggest. Four. Yeah. 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 Just from doing it a long time. I mean, just there's the winner. Because I've just oh, yeah, done it a lot. I go, well, here, you take right. the one that we got the fish on. I'll see if I can find the bottom. There's the man that hooked yeah, that it. That sounds good to me. I was afraid there's of the man that's bringing it in. <laughs> yep. Turn up the pole and pull your testicle. I got two of them. Picking up, like every right fish we hook, I gotta let out a little more yeah. with the next pole. This one, I only had like, I don't know, I didn't have a whole bed, bunch of wraps left when it finally hit the bottom. You ready to start pulling again, Grandpa? Whenever you're giving out. Yeah, just take turns. Taking turns. Taking breaks and put a bed in there and have them. These are definitely out there. They're kind of. Oh, they're kind of fairies, aren't they? They, they don't get my texture. Just lean into it and then 
think the man crank on the way back there. On the big cypress stone. There you go. Just you can you can lean way back. I can. And if you, if the rope breaks, I guess you'll bump your head back. Didn't give any slack. No, no. In the current, they're just going to be there. It's when the bird perches on, on your pole. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. If the current was like this there the whole does. time, you know, oh, not, yeah. not if the, yeah. you know, when they're straight up and down, it makes a difference. If the current was like this the whole day, you can kill yourself. My first. They're still working on it. Summer, I got a job at a feed mill. At a feed mill? Working eight hour shifts, huh? Well, moving bags or something? At the end of the conveyor belt, putting 50 and 100 pounds of sacks on box cars. Wow. That was illness. You got very tough, very fast, and you quit one or the other. I, I hung with it the whole summer. And they paid me union wages, too. Gold was a good job for a college kid. You're doing great, guys. Maybe I better do like that skull man, you know, beat. Boom! Boom! <laughs> We're going to blow up with these poles in the folder and beat the hell out of you, Doc. <laughs> <laughs> Get to your muscles. Here's get off. Yep, well, he did. Came off. <laughs> Man, look at this. Yeah, Got no, a sure. fish head. Oh. Yeah. Oh, wow. Time is they're taking shifts. Something must be a tank. Something must be a tank if they have to take that many shifts. He just wants to fish. <laughs> and see if Uncle Charles is still there. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's, that's exactly what we're doing. I know where this Come one on, is. Come on, Charlie, we're waiting now. Oh, it up. Now we have to oh, wait just on this feet. man right here <laughs> to see if his fish is bigger <laughs> than <laughs> that. I hope he's trying the side, uh, side motion now. One more time. There he is. The one that took forever. There we go. He caught it. How many did you catch today? One? Three, huh? Huh? Yeah. Still working on it. This is the last fish we're bringing in today. His line is somewhere way back there. And then I'll get it back to you. Everybody's fish. Okay. Ain't nothing in it, is there? <laughs> Still working on it. Cookie muscle there. Put some of the moose muscles. Come on, man. 
My mom has bigger muscles than that. Ah. <laughs> Look at that bend. <laughs> That's a nice fish. Yeah, fighting these things in the current, it's, a good size it's about like bill fishing. I'm hoping. So am I. <laughs> Hope from the cat. Is there a fish over there? Yeah. Why? Going pretty easy. It takes all the flex out of the pole and makes it a little easier. Mm -hmm. I mean, they kind of, if you pull hard enough and fast enough, they kind of, they're still moving toward you where on the pole they stop whenever you free them. Not a big one. Sure. A dead one nonetheless. He was just a lot of weight out there. I think that was the most we could see. You're going to stand my head in the stomach. You have to see the boat. <laughs> you see the boat where it's going on. Right there. Yes, sir. That's the best thing oh, right there. Another side of the I don't know, it's a, oh yeah, it's a sea, sea lion. It's a sea lion, it's his nose. Okay. Does that mean that there are killer whales and sharks in the area? Where's your camera, Jim? Oh, there it is. There's probably some kind of shark there. There's salmon sharks.
makes you wonder how they get up there, doesn't it? Look at that one way up there. Stink.
Look at that mess of fish. Woo I can't even get them all in the picture. Can you hold that a second for me? Sure. That's an average of about 360 pounds of fish. Not bad. So, uh, 24 to 33 is what I heard. What was the highest? 29? 37. 37. 20 to 37, yeah. 20 to 37. So, they let us use those tugs? Yeah. They'll let us borrow them. You can to pack. You want to back up? Yes, please. This is Portage Lake. You guys got 30 seconds. What do you think about the trip, Dr. Lindsay? Very spectacular. Y'all ready to go home? You ready to come back? Yeah, anytime. Anytime? Anytime. Next year.